So, I booked a flight with EasyJet to flight out to London. Let me tell you, EasyJet? More like, uh, Hardjet. Anyway, I get to the airport and I found my flight been delayed by three hours. Three hours? Are you serious? Eventually, of course, I did get onto the plane. It was busy, to be expected. I sit in my seat and wait for the plane to take off. It gets worse. Guess who my passenger sat next to me? That's right, an Inwa Argonian. Anyway, we begin to soar through the skies. I figured it'd be a long trip, so I brought the correct copy of Sunder. That should entertain me for a while. Of course, that didn't last long, since a pathetic little elf child started to cry, and its cries of terror rang through the entire body of the plane, piercing both my ears for a solid four seconds. Children, what a grand and intoxicating innocence. Eventually, next day, we landed in London Heathrow Airport. What a relief it was to have my ears clenched of the screams of the damned. I pick up my luggage and begin to embark to find my hotel. I was wearily given I have to carry a large amount of luggage. Unfortunately, I soon discovered I was lost, having no idea how far away I was from the hotel. What stood in front of me was a small alleyway, the walls filled with graffiti and spray paint. Out of nowhere, three yobs jumped me. With their thick accents, it was difficult to understand what they were saying. Fam? Shank? What are these words you project with such a gritty remark? I of course assumed there were casting spells on me. I paused, looking at them confused. Come, lay down your weapons. It is not too late for my mercy, as they seem to stutter in confusion. One of them asks something. But again, due to the accent, I failed to understand them. They gave up and walked away. As I turn around, I was greeted by the same Argonian on the flight I sat next to. They helped guide me towards the hotel. I would give them praise for the help. But it's an Argonian. No, no Nerevar. It's just, you know, lizard people. Always so stinky and in swaps. Harsh. Come now, I'm a god. I don't give a...